Hey guys, there's uh, something I'm going to go over real quick with the new uh, version of the kit hardware. We've got these new updated motors from DYS. They're still the same 1806 2300 kV motors, but um, the bell housing is com and the prop adapter are completely attached, and they're also self tightening prop locks on there. So that means when you change props, you just throw the prop on, spin it down by hand, and just fly it, and they'll tighten on their own. Um, but you need to have them in the right spots on the quad for that to work. And this is how it's set up. So we've got the front of the quad up here and the rear of the quad right here. Your, your black prop locks need to be on the front left and back right and the uh, silvers on those two. And that's because these two right here are going to be spinning clockwise. And with the way this is threaded, it's reverse threaded. So when it spins clockwise, it's actually actively tight, tightening this uh, prop nut right there. Okay, so that's very important. Um, and also, we've got these new DYS ESCs. And with these, I have that build video out there. And the way I solder those old Spider ESCs, to, uh, the motor leads to the ESCs, it's backwards from these. So this back right one, um, you, you need to cross two wires. So I'm going to just do a demo real quick. So I just plug this the left motor lead into the left ESC lead and now I'm just going to cross these other two instead of instead of connecting them straight on and that will effectively make this motor spin clockwise so you can see how these two are crossed and this one is plugged straight on so just make sure you pay attention to that when you're building and for these two right here um, you can plug those straight on from the motor leads to the ESC, ESC leads. You don't need to cross any, and that'll make the, these two spin counterclockwise. Um, if you guys have any questions, just shoot me an email or comment on this video. Uh, thank